Hi, I'm Allison Witheridge, watershed scientist with Denver Water. Today we're out at Beaver Ranch Park near Conifer in Jefferson County, building a series of sediment retention structures in Casto Creek. We're here with our friends at Jefferson County Open Space, building these structures to address sediment moving downstream to Strontia Springs Reservoir and habitat restoration. Hi, I'm Christina Duff with Jefferson County Open Space. As you can see, we have quite a bit of an erosion issue here at Beaver Ranch Park. These banks have been cut over several years, causing a lot of issues specific to habitat and wetland habitat in this area. As the erosion has become worse, the water table is getting lower than the vegetation requires. So this is pretty much eliminating the wetland plants that we want here and bringing in more of a agriculture grassland that is not suitable to this location. So sediment from Casto Creek erodes into our tributaries, into the North Fork, and then settles behind Strontia Springs Dam in our reservoir. This can cause issues for the valves and the pipes in the dam and water quality. My name is Crystal Young and I'm with Jacobs Engineering and I am here today with Denver Water as a watershed planner to try to make improvements to mitigate sediment. So to solve this issue, what we're doing is we are building post-assisted log structures. We will be putting in posts, driving them across the channel, as well as willows that we will tightly weave. So they kind of mimic wood and things otherwise falling in the channel. And the purpose of that is that it'll allow for sediment to deposit and build the channel bed back up behind these structures. So I think this is looking great. Yeah, yeah you're on it. Okay. It's really important to note that these structures are designed to allow water to flow through them and that we're not really retaining any water behind them. So once these structures are put in, our goal is that sediment will be slowed down in the process, thereby building back up this floodplain bed and having the vegetation come back and be really happy and healthy. To provide an example, by building these little low structures in the channel, they'll be very low, will help it fall in on itself and in, in that, we'll build that channel back up. And over time, we'll hopefully build it all the way back up to this floodplain and have a really nice mosaic of plants and habitat. So we look at benefits twofold. One, for conservation purposes, so for the wildlife and all the living creatures in this area to benefit from these restoration efforts, and also for our visitors, so they can enjoy these wetland experiences as they enjoy the trails throughout this system. This is a pilot project, but we are identifying other areas upstream of Strontia Springs Reservoir where we can identify the issues and find solutions to mitigate sediment downstream. We are so excited to be working with Jefferson County Open Space on this. For more information, go to denverwater.org tap.